Well, I'm going to unbox a Deadpool box set courtesy of our friends from Kramer Toy Warden. Once again, this is the second episode of JP Finity Toy Photography Collecting and Customs. Um, I did a live unboxing on Facebook because for some reason I could not go live here. But we're going to do this again since it's very easy to unbox. So this is the Deadpool 5 uh, five pack or box set from Hasbro. Um, the Deadpool in 3.75. Unfortunately, um, yeah, I've opened this box, but we'll do it again. Courtesy of our from our friends at Kramer Toy Warden. And yeah, this looks like a retool of the Deadpool 3.75 from the two pack. Uh, which came with Taskmaster so I'm going to bring out um, a two pack for the Deadpool two pack so yeah it's it's really similar it's the same pretty much the, the color is just a bit more dull with the with the old versions so yeah, it's the same. It's the same mold. It has the same accessories. Although the, the eyes, all the different Deadpools have different, you know, expressions. Some are winking, some are wide-eyed. Um, the packaging is, you know, it's alright. It's not as boring as the Infinite Series box packaging. You know, you still get comic book art. Uh, so you get Fool Killer, Terror, Solo, and Slapstick with Deadpool in the box set. And they're missing uh, Stingray and I forgot the other guy's name. So yeah, this is the 5 pack. Um, it's not the packaging is not as interesting as the um, SDCC box set. You can see the packaging here was really thought about and it's really good. But yeah, thing with the pack, this packaging, it's have to rip it open or cut it open to get to the figure. So unlike the box we have now, I'm going to put this back and just open it up here on here on the side. And then slide it out and it's in a clamshell. Just pop it out, which I did earlier and I'm not going to do it now. Because it's pretty much the same figure in different colors with different expressions. Um, I think this will be the last um, 3.75 Marvel figures that Hasbro will be releasing at least for a while as they have been focusing on their 6 inch scale figures. Which is pretty disappointing. Although they will be coming out with Marvel vs. Capcom figures. Uh, the Iron Man and Mega Man 2-pack already came out. And they're coming out with a Spider-Man and Negative Man 2-pack uh, next. So this is a short video review. Courtesy of our friends from Kramer Toy Warden who gave us these excellent figures because it's pretty much you know one figure in different colors they have the same accessories articulation is the same plastic feels the same packaging is a bit boring unlike the uh, Deadpool Core SDCC and I kind of wish you know instead of putting in 
Wade. They could have put in Stingray instead, and the other guy, other member of Mercs for Money. You know, they could they could have fit in six figures right, and get the complete Mercs for Money. Uh, I guess that's it. Um, thank you guys for watching. Uh, next episode, I think we will be reviewing the Guardians of the Galaxy box set. It's it's a retool, it's a reissue. So watch out for that. Again, thank you Kramer Toy Warden for these awesome figures. Please like, subscribe, and share this video and my YouTube channel. I'm also on Facebook. Please check out JP Finity Toy Collecting custom sand photography and I'm also on Instagram as JP Finney. I'll see you guys next time. Thank you for watching.